Hello guys, today I'm going to be giving you all an update tutorial on how to make a 5M server. Quickly before I get started, I want to mention that if you're looking to make a 5M roleplay community and have a publicly ran 5M server, I highly recommend Rocket Nodes 5M hosting. They have a large array of plans and some of the most advanced DDoS protection technology for your community. If you're looking to get 25% off your first month, please use code CYBER25, which you'll find in the description at checkout and that will give you 25% off and support the channel. Anyways, let's get started. So the first thing we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna click create your own server, host your own server, and that will take us here. Once we're here, we're gonna click setting up a server using TX admin, and we're gonna click this right here. Go to the latest Windows server build listing. Once we're here, we're gonna click latest optional, because this is very outdated. Once we do that, let that load. And now we're going to go to File Explorer as that's downloading. This PC, D drive. And we're going to make a new folder and called FX Server. Exactly how I typed it, capitals and everything. We're going to open it. Open this file. Drag everything. Oops. Drag everything in there. Perfect. Once that's done, First off, just make sure you have Notepad++ for editing the CFG. But now we're gonna left click the FX server.exe. We could close this. Actually, we'll leave it open. So now we're gonna wait. Give it a second. Here we go, perfect. Now it's gonna auto do this. So we're just gonna click link account. If it doesn't auto fill the pin, just type 8816 link account. And then continue. You might have to log in with TX Admin or CFXRE. But now we put in our backup password. Click yes, create master account. Once that's done, now we're just gonna click next. Server name, you're gonna put your server name for whatever. I'm just gonna put cyber test. Next, deployment type. Since we are doing this through TX Admin, we're gonna click popular template. You could use any of these but you might need a database set up for them. So I'm just gonna do CFX default. We're gonna click save and go to recipe deployer. Now we're gonna click next and license key. Now we're gonna go to keymaster.5m.net. Let this load, perfect. Okay, so this is how we're gonna make our key. Display name is going to be whatever you want your key to be called. I'm just gonna call it test. Initial server IP, I'm just gonna put, I don't know, maybe that will work, but you're gonna put your IP, which you can find on whatsmyip.com. I'm just not looking to give out my IP. Server type, we're gonna click other home hosted, and then provider, no. Okay, perfect. Once that's done, we're gonna click copy, and then put this key in the recipe. Once that's done, it's going to open your resources in server.cfg, which we'll add resources to. It's going to also bring us here, and we're just going to click Save and Run Server. Of course, it's going to say this because the key on the IP is wrong, but make sure you put the right key on. I'm going to go back here, just grab an IP with a key that works. Okay, now we're going to go to CFG Editor, scroll down, and Put my new key in. You won't have to do this because your key should work. But anyways, once that's done, what we're going to do is we are going to find a resource to install. So let's go to 5M forums. I don't know. I'll do the delete vehicle script. First one. Make sure you get your scripts on the 5M forums so they're legit and they actually work with 5M because a lot of people try to use GTA mods and they don't work. But we're going to download the script. So basically what you do is make sure this is the main folder that has the FX manifest in it. We're going to drag that in resources. Okay. Once that's done, let's make sure it's there. It is. We're going to copy the name of the file. Then go into TX Admin, EFG Editor. And whatever resource you put, you're going to type in short and then the name of the resource. So it starts when we restart the server. But now, once that's done, we're going to click Live Console and Restart, and we should see the resource load up in our console. 
See, right here, started resource, delve vehicle or whatever. That's our script. All scripts have a similar installation, but if it has an SQL or database folder, you will have to just get a database set up, which if you mention, if you listen to what I said earlier, Rocket Node has instant database setups. It's a little more difficult on localhost. You just need to install XAMPP and a few additional things. So now, since our server's up, we're gonna open 5M. And we are going to connect to it. All right. Wait for that to load. Let me close out some of these. Perfect. So now if you see, it's gonna show desktop here. This is our local host server. Or you could just FA connect space local host. But let's make it easier. I'm just gonna left click this. It might say it needs to be have a restart depending on whatever server you were on last, the game build of it. Let it restart and connect this in. Here we go. So now we are joining the server and it's downloading all the resources right now. This includes the delete vehicle script we just added and we're gonna test it out in game to make sure it works. Once this loads. All right, perfect. Then, all right, now we're in. Well, we spawned in the trailer, but we're in. So. Now what we want to do is we're going to find a car and try to delete it. Because that's what the script we got. Let's, let's, let's what in the world? Ah! The car car sucker. You screw right. yourself. Flash. You think? I'm going to fuck you up real so, good. That's pretty much it. I mean, that's how to install 5M server on oh, your PC you and how to install scripts to it. Now I'm going to proceed to run from this man so he doesn't kill me. Have a good day. Thank you for watching.